I'm gonna be here. Every time when you see, for example, when I see he's gonna, like, he's just gonna move forward a little bit. Before he moves, and, but I feel, look at me, I cannot do this, look at me. No, because he's, he doesn't do anything. I have to wait, then, what I have to look? I have to look at the middle, between the eyes. When I look between the eyes, I can see his action. I'm gonna repeat that like 10 times. <laughs> Like I am, I stop in the middle. I intercept. Anticipate the movement, then I'm gonna leave. Oh, see? Yes. Again. Yes. Don't move, go. Because sometimes if they got move their leg, their legs get not. Move, boom, go. Doesn't matter. Go. Go. Yes. Move your foot a little bit. I don't want you guys to do this. No. If we train fast, we become fast. I'm gonna control the distance and wait for the right moment. Boom! Catch the leg. Catch the leg, throw and punch. I'm not saying that. I have to open the distance like that. Why? Because I have to threat my opponent all the time. I have to keep the range. You know what I mean? Like, that's the range that I have to keep. Extend your arm. You cannot touch. No, you need. I can touch. I have to fight in that distance. That's the distance. But I have to understand. So, now I'll be. When he moves, I cut it. When he moves, I cut it. If he moves forward, move forward, I cut it. I don't let him cross the line. If he crosses the line, I have to hit him. If he crosses the line, I have to move back. Either way. See, keep doing this. Thing. I don't let him cross the line. If he crosses the line, if he crosses the line, I have to hit him. I cannot let him advance, advance too much to read my game. If I keep doing the same, the cycle of repetition, cycle, repetition, you know what I mean? Cycle, repetition, like to do the same technique all the time. I want you guys, like, use the variety, you know? For example, he comes, and boom, he comes, and boom, he comes, and boom, he comes, and boom. Comes and boom. <laughs> you see me, every time when I hit him, I move like a half foot backward. Why? Look at me. But stop. I have to go there, hit him, right? Because he come, he come, boom. If I stay here, I am in his distance now. Boom, boom. He's ready. Now I move half foot back. He comes, boom. Extend your arm.
I'm gonna like move around. What I don't want, I don't want you open the distance too much. Why? Because it's gonna start to chase you. That's what we don't want. I want keeping the range that we should flat hand. Do you, do you know what I mean? If he comes and, and open the distance, he starts to chase me. I don't want that. See, see, now it's hard for me. Why? Because remember the first, the first thing that I said to you, I have to adjust. All the time I have to adjust myself. In a long period of time. Because I punch, he has time to adjust ahead of me. I don't want that. I want to be ahead of him. How? With punching kick. Come, boom, 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 boom. Sometimes he's gonna try to counter me, but I, I can use my fake as well. I use punch, kicks, but I can fake.
to reach me, he has to do a lot of effort. He has to do too much. Then I am, I'm able to see it. So, I know now if I step half foot forward, he's going to do something. Either move backward or attack me. Two choices. Either. Why? Because look at me. Look at me. Still here. If I do this, or it's gonna create a distance, or it's gonna attack me. Yes. I have to understand that when I step forward, I have to be ready. Most of you guys sometimes you step forward without knowing that that distance is gonna do something. If you move backward, it's good. I keep pressing. But what if he attacks me? So I cannot get here in that distance. Like be unaware. Like he try to fight here. He's gonna kill me here. I move back a little bit. I already know when I step forward, he's gonna attack me, right? I have to prepare something to him. For example, I'm here in boom. And also, if I step forward and he doesn't do anything, I do. I have to wait at least, at least one, one second and a half. At, at most two seconds. We cannot do it that distance like you look each other and doing anything. No, I'm not going to do this. I already know. I'm here. Boom. See? I'm here. Wait, if I do anything, I start to move back. I don't know if it's hard to understand that, but imagine if there is a imagine line here. If we cross now, if we cross this line, I'm gonna cross. Now my turn. I'm gonna cross the line. I have to be ready for the next visit. When I cross the line, if he doesn't do anything, I do. I Punch and move back, come back. You have to just understand if you cross that line, you have to be ready to counter, go together, jab me, jab me. Jab me. Jab me. Just because I crossed that line. So let's start with very, let's break the exercise to understand. Now, I cross the line and I'm gonna defend everything. I'm gonna make him move backward. Okay? Cross the line. I want him to punch me and feel like uncomfortable and move backward. Because he's not gonna, unless he's a crazy guy, he wants to exchange. That's that's my job to read during the fight. I cross the line, boom, boom. Cross the line, boom, boom. You see, as soon as you finish the combination, I approach. Before you be ready. Do it again. One, two, and move. I'm not even throw anything. I just want to learn how to deal with that situation. I have to understand how to deal with that situation. The guy doesn't like to do to fight in a short distance. Now I want to pressure him more. What I have to do? Be ready. When I cross the line, I'm ready to defend everything. As soon as he moves, I move. As soon as he moves, I move. It doesn't mean that I cannot move backward a little bit. For example, See, just a little movement by my hand is ahead of him. Because as soon as he punch, I cut him. There will be a moment that he's going to be desperate, like, and frustrated, and also tired, because he spent more energy than me. Because I, I know how to. Guys, I want you to understand that I'm separating every kind of style. The first one, how to keep the guy over there. 
I have to know how to keep it again. Now I want to press the guy. This guy is not a Vanderlei Silva anymore. This guy is a Desani, for example. Oh, you do this game because the wrestlers they don't they don't like move backward and shoot. They don't like this and this because you're gonna be able to see everything. What they like? They like it. Make you move backward and boom, shoot. Right? The training right now, the drill right now is stay here. It's gonna stay still. I'm gonna dance. I'm gonna cross the line, but knowing that. Steve is gonna move backward or attack me. If I want him to throw me something. Okay? Line is here. Cross the line. Cross the line. Cross the line. Control. 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 Okay? Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this, okay? I want to get used to do this cross. Cross. Like that. Okay, then. I cross the line. If he throws, because I put my head to this side. If I put my head to this side, it's gonna punch with his hand. I put my head to the line and boom, he throws jab. I cross the line, he throw his jab. I cross the line, and boom. I go to get I pretend to be out of the uh, south pole to work on that side too. Even if uh, orthodox, you do not. Cross the line, boom. And I go in. Cross, punch, move back. One step. You know what I mean? Like, I have more power. Boom, boom, they move back, switch side, punch. So it's slip and then punch. Okay. Yes, they keep here. Boom. Okay, we're not punch. Ah. <laughs> yes! Funny what you Funny Here and I'm out. Remember, I cannot spend more than two seconds crossing the line. I mean here, for example, for example, if he doesn't do anything, cross the line, boom, cross the line, boom, cross the line, boom, boom. I mean here, he doesn't do anything, I, I do, move back, I mean here, he's gonna do something, I pull back, boom, boom, move, he's gonna punch again, okay, nothing, and then, boom, and again, boom. Then I get boom, boom, boom. Come, boom. And if you want to do that, you have to know distance, time, one step ahead. You know what I mean? Like rhythm. Otherwise, it doesn't matter. You know a lot of technique, but not able to use it. Sometimes you bring different techniques. You have to practice. 
Let you understand the process, the training. You know? Otherwise, it's a waste of time. You have you have to like just a wake up call, like I said, like I have something different that I have because every teacher that comes over here has something different to teach you. You have to take advantage. You know? Learn everything and practice. That's important. Otherwise, you just hear sweat, t shirts, doesn't mean anything. You know? But if you understand and try to use, try to practice, it's when you go to a different seminars, like self development seminar, same thing. Thank you, everybody here for, for made it here. And also, Aaron, Jerry. Why? Thank you so much for everything. Curl or it's curl. He'll see us at lunch. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So thank you because without you guys, I could not be here. Show a little bit of my knowledge, which I think is so important to exchange. You know, I learned so many things here because you teach me. We talk. I see each other. We see each other. That's the main thing. Of everything. Thank you guys. I so I hope to see you guys next time. Okay. I hope you enjoy the class and, and learn something. Thank you guys, let's fall. Thank you guys, thank you, I appreciate it. Thank you.